We begin with that breaking news. A Philadelphia police officer released from the hospital. He was shot in the line of duty last week in Overbrook. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Payute is at Penn Presbyterian Medical Center with more. Good afternoon, Jasmine. Good afternoon, Jim Janelle. After spending nearly a week in the hospital, Officer Julian Jones was released from Penn Presbyterian Hospital today to a crowd of his fellow officers. Take a look. The officers waited as Jones came out, seemingly in good spirits, as he heads home to his family. Police say 31 year old Kofi Zima attacked Jones with a hammer Tuesday, October 26. He, along with another officer, were responding to a disturbance on Overbrook Avenue. According to reports, Zima knocked Jones down and was standing over. Over him when Jones and the other officer, Cindy Williams Doran, started shooting. Jones was shot in the leg and the suspect was killed. Officer Julian Jones is a three year veteran of the Philadelphia Police Department and is currently assigned to the 19th District. We learned today Jones is one of five Philadelphia police officers who have been shot in the line of duty this year. I don't want to use the words no respect for law enforcement, but there's, there's just no sense of consequences for anybody. You know what I mean? And you could see just when they're shooting each other. Uh, now they're just shooting the officers, so it's a dangerous job. I mean, we go, wake up every morning not knowing if we're going to go home at night. It was absolutely amazing to see all the support, uh, and I mean, who wouldn't, you know, it, I think it's helpful to see not only support from, from colleagues and uh, people from the community, but I think that's also helpful in healing, and it shows that we're, we're really resilient not only as individuals, but as an organization. Both Jones and his partner are still on administrative leave. We asked Commissioner Outlaw if the shooting was friendly fire or from a suspect. She says that's still under investigation. We're live outside Penn Presbyterian. Jasmine Payute, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, a story we'll continue to closely follow. Jasmine, thank you for that.